we already work around uh, six weeks now. We start in the other six week. Uh, it, it was in the beginning a little hard, you know, because the guys was out from the real serious training already six, seven months, you know, so it, it, it was hard in the beginning. You need to be very careful to don't get some injuries, you know, by, but by the time everything going well now, we, we don't have that problem with injuries and that's very, very important because they work really good, they work very hard and I'm really satisfied with the, uh, with the level of their performance and their dedication to our training. Well, see, it was interesting. That was my first experience in Africa. You know, I worked before in the Gulf in Kuwait, in Bahrain, in Europe, in Slovakia, and was the national team. A lot of experience, but it was first time in Africa, and it was real uh, uh, challenge for me uh, to adapt so fast here. But I, I, I managed it, and uh, I need to say that the, the main reason for our success was. Uh, all, all people in the world work together for the same goal, you know. And I really had great help and from the owner of the club, Jonathan Jackson, and from CEO Patrick and coordinator Samson. You know, everybody know what is his part of the job and nobody interfere in, in, in other parts of the job, you know. So uh, this was very, very important. The second thing, I had really great communication with the players, great team atmosphere and we keep it that through the whole season. And they were really happy to have chance to work some professional type of trainings like we do in the Europe. And they were delighted and they were excited uh, for a new, new way of work and new challenges. In the end, through this, I can say hard season last year, uh, that uh, brings us really great result and we have our 20 four victories, just four draws and two losses, and maybe 10 matches before the end, we were already in the Premier League. So no matter uh, about the Corona start and they stopped the championship, we were already secured with last match win against Nairobi's team, our direct opponent. So uh, I can say I can be really, really satisfied with that season and I, I hope we will make positive impact even in the Premier League. And I believe this team really, uh, really possess something special. This is great guys. And I believe it will be positive surprise in this year in the Premier League. But see, you don't want to make mistakes like some clubs before. Uh, you need to stay the humble, you know, when you enter from the second league in the Premier League, uh, your first target is to stay there in Premier League. And when we spoke in the club, I told them, for my opinion, the, the, the most important thing to make stable club who will stay in the Premier League and by time uh, become very, very serious opponent for the biggest club in, in, in Kenya. Uh, what I can tell you that we are already, I can say, sure between two, three most uh, best organized clubs in, in, in the Kenya. And all the structures in the club, everything is in the right place. And that was our target. And now we will go match by match. And I hope really that we can achieve some good, good result. Uh, but again, we will stay humble, we will work hard. And I hope uh, from that hard work and professional work, uh, we will achieve good results this season. But see, I, I, I use last, uh, last year, I, I, I watched many matches in the Kenyan Premier League, so I already know the level of the Kenyan Premier League. And um, when I told you about the structure in the club, from the time I arrived, together with the people around me, what I mentioned before, uh, we make the strategy, you know, so in the like winter transfer window, we buy four or five players who were Premier League players or national team players like Pinches, Aziz, and uh, so we, Odera. So we make the targets that we don't come in the situation that we come in the summer and buy 12 or 15 new players. We keep the skeleton of the team uh, who understand each other very well. We brought just few important players that like came from the Kamega Homeboys uh, or from Bija or Rogers from the Coast Tima, but I saw them in the last season. 
from Sharks, uh, Sven Mida. So uh, that was target players what we chose and we did guys what we brought in the winter so they have time to adapt for our system of the work. I think we did a good job and we will, we, we will be good positive, positive surprise, positive story in Kenya this season, I'm sure about it. Well, he played in Qatar, you know, I work in the Gulf in Kuwait and Bahrain and I can tell you if you play in Qatar Premier League, you are a high quality player, you know, because they bring just the best possible players and pay them a lot of money. Uh, see, the pinch is, what I can say, like the personality, great guy, a great person, like the player, a high quality player and really, really great professional. Uh, each training he is in the top level, but I'm surprised and he's a really good example for the young players. And I'm really happy to have that guy in my team. And I can believe he came in that moment in Nairobi City Stars and uh, with him, with uh, Muki and Salim Abdella, Shitu, I think we really have three, four guys who are great leaders in the team and they behave in the pitch and outside the pitch like great captains and they are big help for me in any moment. But see, Kenya, beautiful country with uh, really some nice uh, people uh, always smiling, like to like to joke, like to enjoy in the life. Uh, the weather is great, and I can be really honest and say that I enjoy my time in Kenya. And I hope I hope we will make something special, and that people will see how much we work hard and how much in the same time we enjoy our work, and how we can present this. We can present in the pitch, in our matches, and I, I'm sure when people come to watch us, when, when ministry allowed, <laughs> that they will enjoy Nairobi City Stars matches and they, they will come to support us. Uh, Kenyan favorite, Chapati, that's number one. <laughs> I, I know everybody say Ugali, Ugali, they like Ugali, but in my country we like that, that type of the bread, so Chapati was great and with goat meat, with some sauce, you know, they put it with Ugali, but I like to take with Chapati, so that was really, really, really my favorite food here. Ah, just little some words, nothing special to be honest. Ah, Sava Sava <laughs> or something like this, just simple some words in Swahili. We, we, we like to joke too much, we have really good atmosphere and they are, they already learn, you know, uh, when we work hard and when we work serious and when I'm angry they know that. <laughs> but 90% of our trainings it's good atmosphere, good fun and they know really to make balance between hard work and enjoying in our training. Uh, this Vicky like to joke too much, but, uh, and, but that, that, it's really positive team, you know, like Vicky, Jimmy, you have always few guys, you know, who make good atmosphere there, but all they are really positive and they are really humble guys. I can say something, but I mentioned in my country, when I speak with all my friends, coaches in national team where I worked before, that I never worked with a team who is so humble, like the persons and the players like here in Kenya with Nairobi City Stars. Uh, all team is really hard working. I can tell you maybe 95% of the team, what is not usual, it's really hard working. Uh, but like the professional, maybe the pinches is always in the top level. Always in the top level. Ganisha. So, Siko and Taka, my lieutenant, to get on the Sumbana Mboa contract. So, we have options Billy, Ningasan, maybe Bidco, Hama, Apa Pia Korea, and Tumidana for long. So, to the Putana, that in Maya Pika, because Mumza and Aitawa, Aita Kwangu, no one on the inside to set the lava. I got a pressure, pressure me with any of the talk. Ah, experience in Kwapoa. I may come back after a very long time Kenyan football. No, no. And Kapata Mabijano, I grow sana on a Pidangoma, or Bizodogo, I come in a bomba sand. 
No, mimi hata na wani kama nilikuwa timu ishapanda tayari kwa sababu ile kaliba ya quality kwa hapa hawa wachezaji wa maboys tayari ni kama walikuwa shapanisha team. Mimi yani nilikuwa pia nina na kama nani bamba tu kucheza nao kuwa nao pamoja unaona so naona ni kama sio sisi tulipanisha timu au mabonzo walikuwa shapanya kila kitu sisi tu ni kuja yani tu tukule keki pamoja unajua just good football au mabonzo wanajua ball sana 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 niko sure yani by the time tunamaliza first leg ndio wao watakuwa na shule team na boys wa poa sana kwa nyumba ball so expect uh, a lot of things a lot targets bado tujaongea kuhusu targets lakini kimimi mimi naona kwanza hawa boys kwa sababu ya yangu yani wabaki kwanza kwa league alafu ndio baadaye mambo ya kujipajipa kidogo shapata hizo new experience na kidogo tunaweza kushinda na kucheza Champions League labda